Bison Trail Boss 7308 here at Haylet RV of Coldwater, Michigan. Um, we tend to carry these two different ways, with ramp and without ramp. In the past, and uh, we probably have units in stock right now without the ramp that are basically very, very similar. Uh, we've had a, a big outcry though for a lot of folks looking for this model specifically with ramp. So we've kind of started keeping her both ways. Um, this video is here to kind of give you the, uh, the, the you know ups and downs of everything. Uh, you know every horse trailer, every gooseneck is really good for different reasons. So why spend your money with the Bison? Why with the Trail Boss? That's what this is about to show you the things that makes this unique and desirable, and then you can decide if it's worth your investment. We like to put a power awning on these, and uh, Bison actually has um, they're uh, really owned and operated now. Previously, they're owned and operated by the folks from Monaco, which is a high-end motorhome uh, coach. And uh, now, they are owned and operated by um, Thor, the largest RV manufacturer in the world. And, you know, Thor decided, hey, we want to take our knowledge over into horse trailers. So we're seeing things like the nicer RV power awnings here with the full LED light strip. And some of that had kind of translated through in Monaco. Another respected RV name was involved. And we're seeing more and more of that come through now. The uh, president of Bison is the guy who oversees Crossroads RV, and they are a very quality, well-respected trailer. We carry two or three of their brands here at our dealership, actually. It was a move we were excited to hear about. Um, what's nice is you're getting all of the things in the horse trailer section from Bison's years in horse trailer knowledge with the benefit of the largest RV manufacturer tweaking and updating their living quarters a little bit. It's really it's it's really slick. Um, so we've got triple drop down windows here. Notice that even the front escape door gets its own drop down window and it's the exact same shape and size. If you do get a drop down window a lot of times I have noticed many manufacturers will make it a little bit smaller. Um, the 7308 stands for seven foot wide, three horse, eight foot short wall. This is all aluminum. This is seven six tall. Good for tall animals. Has the extra headroom in the bunk space you are going to want and need. Uh, LED uh, exterior lights out here on the tail, uh, so you don't have to worry about you know marker lights and tail lights going out and replacing those. All aluminum dividers, padded dividers, uh, removable saddle uh, rack. All windows open for ventilation. Uh, you know even here on the butt side. Um, if you notice, if you start measuring, the ramps on these are a little bit longer than uh, the ramps on most trailers. And uh, that's really nice because it, it makes a very easy angle of incline for your animals. It'll feel more natural, they're going to be less skittish about loading, and it's just it's safer for horse and rider. Um, especially when they're backing out of this thing, when they don't have that big drop, they're, they're going to relax a lot more. Um, you know, it always goes down to horse and rider trust. But if you have a horse where you haven't had the opportunity to build that trust yet, this is a great trailer. Um, you know, take a look at these welds. They are serious and it's fully welded. It's not just side tack welded or anything like that. They go the extra mile to make this stuff heavy duty. All aluminum dividers, removable, padded, and easy one hand operated doors. We like to put the stud curtain on here. Uh, for a couple reasons. One, if you got a stud and he's a little gnarly, you can kind of keep him bottled up a little bit and you want to keep your other horses safe and keep the stud safe too. Um, the other thing is, most people with a three horse trailer only have two horses. So we call this the stuff wall, where you can throw your bales and your extra tack and all that extra stuff you need to take with you. Um, the uh, Let's move forward here. We do have a pass-through door straight to the bathroom facility. That's one of the big advantages of going to the 8-foot short wall versus the 6, is it does open uh, the door for a larger living quarter uh, bathroom here. Instead of the little closet bath, you actually get a very nice bath here where you can actually you know, change a pair of pants or something like that. If you're, if you're at an event, you're between heats, you need to change your clothes, this is a trailer you can do that. And you see all the, pant or the uh, well, pantry and closet and linen storage that we've had here in this bathroom. This is excellent. Plus, you do still get a nice full shower that a grown person can actually climb into. And because this trailer is 7'6 tall, you do not ever have to worry about bonking your head in this thing. Plenty of headroom. Uh, moving forward, uh, again, the, uh, the living quarters up front here is uh, definitely... Uh, I, I've seen some some very positive 
improvements uh, since the, uh, I don't know, change of regime, whatever you call it here. But the fit and finish on everything, your your corner uh, meets here, where the, your, your trim meets up, it is, everything is spot on since they brought some of their RV people in over from the Crossroads place to, uh, to help tweak some of the methodology behind putting this together. The shell has always been great. It was just a couple little fit and finish items we started noticing creeping up in our bisons, and instantly, as soon as, um, you know, the ownership changed recently, all that was changed over. They um, basically tweaked their processes so that the living quarter conversions of these are essentially built just like, uh, you know, a, a fifth wheel um, is, is built. And when they brought that consistency and that cookie cutter method over here, everything fell into place. A couple other nice things is these had DVD stereos. They've now upgraded to Bluetooth DVD stereos. It's just another nice little thing. You know, who is this trailer for? Because we build every trailer with a different person in mind. And this is this is a good, reliable, long-term working man's trailer. Or woman's trailer. Pardon me, I don't want to be too abrupt there, but you know what I mean. Working person's trailer. The person who works for a living, who doesn't get to do this full-time, but needs something nice, reliable, something they can feel proud of owning. That's exactly who this is for. Neat thing with this power awning, you wake up at night and there's a wicked storm. You literally don't even have to get out of bed. You don't have to put on pants. And you can roll your awning up on this thing. It's pretty slick like that. Another nice thing I like, easy, battery disconnect. Now, all these modern electronics, like the, the, the circuit panel in your refrigerator, in the water heater, in this DVD player, if you put it in a TV, they always trickle draw off the battery. So, a handy disconnect like that, hard guarantees that your batteries don't go dead on you. And I'm looking up here, and these are LED lights. That's new. That is sharp. Those are sharp-looking light fixtures, and they are nice and bright in here. You saw how well it brightened up. Uh, let's spin you around real quick, take a quick look at the kitchenette. Uh, pretty standard uh, refrigerator in an 8-foot short wall with a good bathroom. You do need to stick with the slightly smaller fridge, otherwise you're just going to have no room for anything else. Now, I do like the little stainless steel appliance package, and I like how they opened up this pocket. Just that extra bit of storage, every single ounce counts. Um, extra wardrobe space here, hanging clothes. You know, if you got 40 shirts you want to take for a two-day weekend, like I have tended to see from our horse trailer clientele, then you're going to like extra stuff like that. Um, you know, if you have any other questions, do not hesitate to give us a call. There are a lot of reasons that Bison is literally the number one producer of living quarter horse trailers and growing. So give us a call, 800-256-5196. Halid Auto and RV. Take care, folks. Stay safe. Happy trails.